A Belgian astronaut from the European Space Agency has been training with the Japanese Space Agency JAXA in readiness for a six-month stay on board the International Space Station. Frank de Winner, who is set to become the first European commander of the ISS, has spent two weeks in Tsukuba, Japan, preparing for the challenges ahead. The training here in Tsukuba is going very well. The people are highly professional uh, and we learn a lot about the GEM, the Japanese uh, experimental module, about the HTV, the cargo module of the Japanese that will arrive during our increment and also all the robotics tasks that we as a crew will have to execute. Frank has been a member of the European Astronaut Corps for nine years and this will be his second flight to the space station. His mission will begin in May when he'll be launched on board a Russian Soyuz vehicle along with Canadian Space Agency astronaut Robert Thursk and the Russian cosmonaut Yuri Lonchakov. Robert Thursk has been training with Frank in Tsukuba along with Andrei Kopers, the Dutch astronaut who'll be acting as Frank's backup for the mission. The training is on schedule. Uh, we're just a, a short time away from launch now. I can feel the confidence building and I can see that uh, my colleagues and I are going to have uh, a very successful expedition. The training here in Japan is, uh, is uh, very good. Um, the team is very, very well prepared. Facilities are good, so we get a very good training to become specialist on the Japanese module. Uh, yes, we're very pleased with uh, both facilities and, and the trainers. Very good training. Frank has been preparing to conduct experiments and demonstrations devised by scientists from across the world. He's also been trained to operate a robotic arm which is attached to Kibo, the Japanese experimental module. He'll use this arm to add experimental equipment to the outside of Kibo. The mission will be Frank's first long duration stay in orbit and he's had to work hard to prepare himself for this unique test of endurance. The most difficult part in a long duration mission is to make sure that during the whole duration of the mission you stay concentrated and you can work in a very good manner together with the other crew. Of course all the crew members are very highly trained, we all know exactly what to do, but for six months maintaining your concentration and maintaining a good mood on board is certainly one of the key factors to success. Due to the international nature of missions to the space station, efforts are made to ensure a degree of consistency throughout the various training centers. Cooperation between the participating space agencies has made life easier for these astronauts as they undergo what is already a demanding training program. Inside the training center, uh, the people are very professional. Uh, the whole partnership has made a big effort to make sure that all the training in all the training centers uh, are very similar for all the astronauts and they have succeeded wonder well here in Tsukuba to do that for us. A lot of the training is hands-on and we feel very comfortable to execute all the tasks in the Japanese segment during our mission. As Frank de Winner and his colleagues prepare themselves for the physical and mental challenges of space, Europe looks forward to new levels of responsibility on board the International Space Station. ESA's first commander will soon be ready to put his training and experience into action.